Hey, what up, guys, and welcome to another GTA video. Before we get started, I'd just like to say thank you so much for to my YouTube sweating in subscribers. Without a doubt, for starting this, I wouldn't expect five subscribers. Never mind 29. He's actually been my inspiration. Actually making me want to put out these videos every day for you people, for your enjoyment, for your entertainment. And right now, as it's always been words, cannot describe how thankful I'm at to have your loyal support. And that's every day I oh, put the intro in and I know it's the usual intro, but deep down I'm thinking, ah, God, I'm so privileged and very humble that I've got this much subscribers. Well, mate, continue, and we'll get straight into the game. What I want to do is, people have been grabbing me about my haircut. So we'll go get a a haircut. Got a bit swag. See what we can get done. Come in, come in, taxi. Let's see what you like. Let's see what you like. Go over there. The Baldy. Hey, Baldy. Oh dear. Those buttons looking far. I will go with I don't get that. How the fuck am I supposed to cut a beard on? Boy, can it. Look like the game. I think got a. I think a bit. A tattoo. Is that tattoo available? I do not actually know tattoos. get dragged into this we both know you always been sweet on me <laughs> shit franklin clinton shit your ass must be high or something i told you i don't do that shit no more i mean i baby doze now and again just for the taste but i'm doing good boo your eyes don't lie whatever you say girl come on here's jb's truck let's go bring the cha-ching homie well then Get 
can. Whatever, they'll live. Vehicle 29, come in, this is dispatch. We got an abandoned car at San Andreas Avenue. Yo, we on that like ugly on your mama. 10-9, come again? I didn't catch that. It's Tanya, fool, and my boy Franklin. We filling in for JB. Uh, copy that. Uh, hi, Tanya. Car's a junker. Been there for days. 10-7. I'm gone. A bucket. This one should be easy. Shit, not easy enough for JB to drag his ass out of whatever crack house he laying in. His loss, yo gain, sugar. Except I ain't gaining shit, sugar. Move that seat back, and you know I'll make it right for you. That ain't what I'm saying. Damn, Tanya. What the fuck happened to you? Okay, I've seen JB do this a hundred times. Back up close, make sure the hook is down, and it should slide right in. Aight, baby. Back it up nice and steady. Okay, we are in, baby. Let's get this back to the lot. Hey, this was not how I saw my day going. I've been trying to branch out. Can't stay in Chamberlain Hills forever. Oh, nigga got airs now. I remember you before you was a wannabe when you just was. And I remember you and JB before y'all was dope in. Shit changes. You the one all turfed up. JB smoking, but he ain't smoking homies. He out here grinding, towing cars, paying bills. For real. Cause I could have sworn it was me out here touring cars for him. And looking damn fine doing it too, baby. Okay, we make the drop where they got the areas marked. They get real finicky when we don't leave it in the right place. Oh my god. Damn it, Franklin. We unhooked. I'll see you on the block. Anything you need. You holler at me. Let me man, fucking more. Where is that fool? Gotta check my jetters. Clearly, like this car is classy. Very, very. Very, very, very classy. Too jazzy. I can't do that again. That's a calm down, my head. I should just be at the top here. That's it, that's it. Uh. We're good, we're good to go. Hey, you stop it! What's up, 
up, man? Get out of my way. Michael, calm down. What the fuck is going on? Nothing happened. It was a misunderstanding. She fucked the brick in my bed. <laughs> Bullshitting. It wasn't like that. You in? Fuck it, I'm in. Let's roll. Let's get this mother. Just don't kill him! Toma, Gita. My wife is what happened. Which guy? The guy I'm paying to teach her tennis. The tennis coach? Oh, that's fucked up, man. Who is dude, homie? You know, back in the hood, man, we gotta watch out for the mailman, dog. Yeah, I'm a cuckold, a snob, and a fucking cliche. He went left up there, dog. You can know Right in the rest is absolutely terrible. Fucking wife, you're going to die. The truck. Fatty cable to one of those supports up there. You finna pull his deck down? Hey, that prick pulled my marriage down. Man, you really gonna be this fucking dramatic? Yeah, whatever. I told you I caught the session, bud. But there were a lot of freaking sessions, bud. I think you were working on more than just her backhand. Mandy's backhand has come a long way, bro. But sometimes it's gotta get worse to get better. Yeah, well, maybe I should come up there and practice my backhand on your face. Oh, bud, your negative energy is seriously bringing me down. Oh, I hope it is, bud. We hooked up, man. You come into my house, take my money, and nail my wife? Are you fucking kidding me? I'm going to stick up my hand and say that was uncool, bud. My bad. Seriously. Oh, how fucking magnanimous. May I please offer you my applause? You fucking motherfucker! No! And we'll see how you like when someone fucks with your shit! Well, hey! Wait! You got the wrong idea, pal! Whoa. Fuck! Here we go! Ha <laughs> ha! Let's see what happens! Dude, you are probably crazy! <laughs> oh, shit! Sorry, ma'am, but already! Let's go. Hey, homie, ain't drugging outside tonight, y'all. Boom, give it some. Are you fucking serious, nigga? Nice. Ain't gonna be no fucking denied. Shit, we got some heavies on us, homie. 
You kidding me? Get it. Can you do something? I'll try, man. Try. We can handle this, right? Screw them. Push the pedal, man. We gotta move. Got one of those bastards. Uh-oh. That guy got it. He's a bitch. Okay, we go back to my house to think about this. Wow, shit, you did good. I mean, I don't know if you hit anyone because your aim's all over the place, but I appreciate the backup. Ah, oh, thank you. Are you sure I didn't hit? Uh, maybe go to a shooting range and work on your aim before we go out again. Oh fuck, man. Shit, you good? Whew. Hey, thanks for the help out there today, kid. I had no idea it was gonna get that hot. Shit, pulling houses off the hillside sure has a weird way of fucking with people. Yeah, well, I thought I was through with all that shit. I don't know what the hell's going on. Oh shit, I think we're about to find out. Do you know who I am? Do you know who I am? Do you? No. Who are you? You? I think so. Good. I know who you are. I know where you live. Who are you? I'm Frank. License. Now, Frank. Maybe hell, Mr. De Santa here. Who am I? I think Martin Madrazo. Good boy. Now maybe give him a little of the background. Man, Mr. Madrazo. It, Mr. Madrazo is a legitimate businessman who was wrongfully accused of running a Mexican-American gang and a narcotic ring, but the charges were dropped because of the witnesses came up missing. Smart kid. Now, Michael, I've got a question for you. What did you put an architectural, significant, modernist, wonder home down the hillside in Vinewood Hills? I thought the owner was banging my wife. Well, that was a strange house for a tennis coach. <sighs> Why was I thinking straight? Clearly. Yeah. <sighs> well, Natalia will need a hotel while you finance the reveal, won't she? Sure. Good. And I'm guessing here that if the rebuild uh, will be somewhere in the 2.5 million range. <laughs> of course. Great. That's nice. Nice. Come on, man. <coughs> you all right? Never better. So what now? Looks like I'm gonna have to postpone my retirement. Fuck. Oh, man, I'm mortgaged up to my eyeballs. Look, I only know one way to make money. I'm gonna have to give an old friend a call. Lester. I think he's in town somewhere. I'm gonna have to track him down. Just give me a little alone time, all right? All right, dog. Not too bad. Went to the get mission team. Whoa, that says I'm not bad. For Lester Crest. Who's, Who's asking? asking? Who's asking? Who's asking? You're all You're crazy. crazy. <laughs> <laughs> uh, even, even for a dead, dead man, man. Michael. Michael. Ooh, you don't sound good, buddy. Mm -hmm. Tactful and, and charming, even, even in death. death. Hey, come, hey, come see, see me, me, old friend. friend. I'm, living I'm living in Los, Los Santos, Santos, just like you. you. Marietta Heights. Heights. Whoa, whoa, wait. Hey, how do you. Hello? You fucker. So go see the last though. See what he's got for me.
back. Hey. Michael, Michael. Well, I'm well, looking through my appointment book, book, book and I don't, don't see your name. name. Yeah, well, I'm more of a walk-in guy, Doc. You know that. Walk-ins walk are more expensive, but I'm always, always happy, happy to, accommodate. to accommodate. Sure, you'll accommodate me as long as I got money in my pocket, right? Hey, I'm in a bad way, Doc. I might come by soon. I'll go see this route. There's that fucking mission over here. Supposed to be what you say. Come in, Michael. Oh, yeah, thanks, Doc. How have you been? Oh, good. Things been good. No, actually, things ain't been good. Things been a far fucking way from good. I've been uh, acting out. That's what you would call it, I think. Right? Acting out. So, what exactly has been the problem? I'm not good, Doc. Not good at all. I'm sorry to hear that. <laughs> Tell me. I don't know. I guess we've been having these conversations long enough that I, I can recognize a trigger when I see one. You know? The shit that's gonna put me right over the fucking edge. Like my family. My son. <laughs> my daughter. My wife. Especially my wife. I mean, they just set me right off, Doc. You know, there's been this episode. You know, actually it was a culmination of a series of episodes. I pulled this Mexican's house right off the fucking hill. I mean, I, I think I'm back in it, Doc. I'm back into life. I mean, I gotta make some money, and there's only a couple ways I know how to do it. You feel the need to explain your decisions, Michael. Take responsibility. So, any other violent urges, friend? I ain't been a good boy, Doc. I mean, you know, things just all of a sudden get up on top and right fucking on top. And then I lose my shit and I hurt people and then I feel bad about it. I, I'm a fucking prick. Remorse is good, but not as good as taking control before you act out. I just want to be happy, Doc. That's so bad. Okay. And what about your sexual behavior? I've been a really good boy, Doc. Really good. Not one problem. I'm glad to hear that. Really glad. Keep working it. This is great. I just ain't myself right now, Doc. Not since my life went crazy. You're plainly addicted to chaos. Well, I'm not sure that's true, Doc. <laughs> I'm not exactly enjoying myself. What I'm addicted to is not getting killed. But for some reason, I could get my ass into situations where getting killed is a little hard to avoid. What about the people you kill? Well, yeah, but 
That's not for fun. Are you sure? Who exactly are you asking, Doc? Am I a psychopath who enjoys suffering? Or a sociopath who doesn't give a flying fuck about the rules? Come on, we've already had this conversation, right? I'm neither. I'm just a fat, washed-up jock who can't get his head around the fact that his high school football career didn't play out the way that he planned. The only way I'm content and, and competent is with a gun in my hand or a price on my head. You're very defensive, Michael. Do you consider yourself a failure? I pay you to listen to my problems. I'm rich, I'm miserable. Half the time my kids can't stand me, the other half my wife is cheating on me. I kill people without remorse, Doc. I'm pretty average for this town. That's the shot. I think I'm having a breakthrough here, Doc. This... I think... No, no, I know. I'm just terrified that I'm, I'm sure gonna... you are, but... That's really all we have time for. See you next time. Okay. Not too bad. Five hundred quid for now. Not too bad. I'll take that. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that seems to be the end of this episode. If you're new around here, please hit that subscribe button, and if you're liking it, and of course, please hit that like button. And as always, I shall see you guys later. Bye.